Happy Monday, friends. Thank you for visiting me here today on Cottage to Courtyard. For today's video, I'll be sharing a Christmas makeover on a beautiful frame that I showed you all a couple of weeks ago. Plus, I'll be sharing a very small but beautiful shopping haul from the fabulous Houston Nutcracker Market that I went to on Saturday. So let's have a look. Okay, let's first start with my tiny haul. When I went to the Houston Nutcracker Market, I already had in mind what I was looking for, and that was some high quality, four inch wide Dupioni Christmas ribbon. And boy, did I score. I love, love, love this rich plaid ribbon. And then as I walked around, I found a vendor with these gorgeous plaid table runners almost matching and I couldn't resist. It's reversible so I can use it both ways and I love the red and green tassels at each corner. Aren't these things gorgeous? So let's go in and have a closer look at the beautiful ribbon and table runner, shall we? Okay friends, let's talk about the frame that I made over and here it is as it was before I changed it. I showed you all this Christy Rapassi original painting in its frame a couple of weeks ago and explained that I was going to carefully remove the painting and save it for later use, but I wanted to create a sign for my Christmas decor this year in the bed and breakfast style. So we removed the painting and purchased a piece of plywood and I painted it in a cream color. And then I, we purchased this Forbidden Red paint by Bear Paint at Home Depot and I painted the frame in this color. It turned out beautiful. And here's how it looks. After I painted the frame in the Forbidden Red, I lightly distressed it and then applied antiquing wax over the top for an aged look. And then after I painted the Aunt Deb's bed and breakfast to the sign, I mod podged some window clings as well as some napkins on it to give it a fun and very rustic look. Then I added antiquing wax over that to also give it a very worn and aged look. What do you all think? I will show you all where I hung this cute sign on Wednesday in my Christmas bedroom tour, so I hope you'll tune in to watch that. All right, sweet friends, that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you so much for joining me today and seeing what I've been doing and my little haul. Please come back on Wednesday to watch my Christmas bedroom tour. I think you'll really enjoy that. Until then, you all take care. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.